Welcome back to another episode of Cutter Uncut. We're here at the Casa Max house. We're interviewing all of the hottest guys. This is awesome. Now we have with us Kyle Steele. Welcome. Hi, thanks for having me. Welcome, Kyle. Thanks for having us. The audience is cheering. Yay! <laughs> That's part two, remember? Oh, part yeah. two. <laughs> Kyle's gonna come back for part two to yes. Vegas. Where are you from? Dallas. So it's not too far. Yeah, it's easy flight. Where are you from originally? In Dallas. Born and raised? Yeah, so right outside Dallas, and then I went away from college. Um, it was really cold, and I realized I hate the cold, so I went back. Where was college? Uh, Northern Indiana. What? That's where I'm from. Oh, really? Warsaw. I thought you looked familiar. <laughs> Seriously, that's crazy. What part were you in? Uh, Notre Dame. Oh, yeah. yeah. We went Tons. there. Yeah, we, we watched did. the, um, what was that thing called? The football thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You know the football they thing They, they kind of like games. it up there. It's really weird. <laughs> yeah, Notre Dame's really hard to get into. So you must be smart. I am a science nerd. You're a science nerd? Yeah, so. Well, people say smart, but I make really bad decisions. Are you book smart? But book yeah, yeah. Smart, I just have a good memory. World smart. I'm world smart, but I ain't book smart. Oh, I'm world stupid. Yeah. <laughs> we'll teach you. I got it. I'm like, ooh, look at Dark Alley. Let's explore it. Cool. Have you been in any? I have. Do you want to tell us about one? Well, my favorite one. No. <laughs> <laughs> I never really remember them. I'm usually stumbling out of them. Yeah. Oh, how did I end up in there? Literally. We are obviously in an adult content creation house. Do you do OnlyFans, Just for Fans, Studio? Like, what's your vibe? Where are you at? Um, all three. So, I started OnlyFans um, just a few months ago, and then um, I lost my job in November. And so I just decided to, like, direct all my energy towards this. I did porn for uh, a small studio in college. Mm -hmm. um, so I did that to, like, pay for college. And so I decided I'm just going to jump back into it. Yeah. So I reached out to the guy that I did that for, and he's since joined a much larger studio. Um, and so I've done three shoots with them, and then I just made the Just For Fans. So I'm uploading everything on my OnlyFans to that. So I'm slowly just expanding in all directions, hopefully. Yeah, I just made a Just For Fans too. I'm waiting for it to get verified though. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. for this specifically? Uh, I mean for this and for other stuff. Yeah. I thought you guys it, make pee videos. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. True. Videos of me. Yeah, you can be a little more flexible. Mm-hmm. And I pee like a bunch, so I can just film like every day. As, like you pee stuff. every day. <laughs> can you believe it? Yeah. Like, God, you're a freak. What is I mean, wrong with you? A confession. I don't drink water because I hate going pee. Like, I just hate the inconvenience of having to go to the pee. So... It's like the most first world problem I've ever had. <laughs> but he loves the convenience of a headache. Don't you just hate, like, water everywhere? We have access to it. <laughs> it's so Then you have to pee. Desert, even. <laughs> There's a water crisis, but I'm not contributing, so it's fine. <laughs> yeah, you're helping the water crisis. Yes. Speaking of water, <laughs> we need to cool down. <laughs> Should we take our shirts off? It's hot, right? Let's do it. Yeah, I'm sweating <laughs> yeah. in this desert. So in this, the desert. In this yeah. 50 this, degree, this warm yeah. breeze. <laughs> I see why you joined OnlyFans. <laughs> wow. Jeez. So muscular. I try. You've only been to the gym once. Only one time, yeah. yeah. I'm still on the free trial membership. <laughs> Seven days. Yeah, I just changed my name and keep renewing that. Perfect, yeah. Don't pay for a gym membership. Just change your name. Yeah. Yeah. No, I learned in college that if I don't work out, I get really sad and oh. unpleasant to be around. Yeah. Mm, okay. Keep working out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Did you go to the gym today? I actually didn't, and so I've been kind of mopey today. Oh. I'm literally planning to do a workout after this. Let's go do some push-ups, or you can do some now. I can do triangle push-ups. Those are fun. That's where the boobies come from. Mm -hmm. uh, I need Wait. to work on those. Those don't grow with me. You have nice boobs. The boobies. Yeah. He does, not yeah. me. You're getting there. <laughs> I want boobs like yours. <laughs> triangle, it's all triangle push-ups. I'm not even kidding. With weights on your back. Yeah. You can have some or a twink. On your back and you or push twink. them up. Or what? Or a twink. If you want to like start you, off easy. You said you uh, lost your job in November. What were you doing work-wise? I was doing what I should not have been doing. So um, I'm a geneticist. And I went on this tangent of being like, well, do I really want to be a geneticist? I've worked in a lab my whole life. And so um, I became a field engineer because I was like, oh, I'll go into a different side of science. I'll go work in the field. It was awful. I hated it. Uh, and like, no offense to any engineers out there. It's just not for me. Yeah. Like a, a geneticist meaning like you clone things? Um, so I worked in cellular biology, uh, specifically in like epigenetics and how... Um, 
So epigenetics is how like your genome adapts to your environment. Um, oh. Basically the volume on their hardcore, hardcore genes. Um, and so I was doing research for that oh. in grad cool. school. Yeah. But once I graduated grad school, I was like, God, I've done this for like a decade. I'm going to try something else and make money. And yeah. It was not worth it. Yeah. A paycheck is not happiness. Happiness is happiness. Right? <laughs> yeah. Happiness. The ha is happiness. Happiness brings me happiness. <laughs> ha. More on penis. Hop on this. <laughs> penis. Hop. If penis. we say penis, you drink. Yes. <laughs> penis. 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 <laughs> oh, wait. They drink. Yeah. For you. Speaking of sex, how many times have you come in a day? Today? Or in a most. day? The most in a day. The most in one day. I was like the horniest high schooler ever. I sw like eight. Eight? Maybe nine. Today. Today would be three. Wow. Three so far? Yeah. Wow. You ready for four? It's about average. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. <laughs> Part two. It's about out. average. Yeah, I won't even fake it. <laughs> <laughs> Just get that, like, stuff that you spray out. Right? Oh, yeah. The, like. Do people do that? Is that a real thing? We shouldn't break anyone's. Oh, yeah. No, it's always it's real. real. Porn is real. Always real. Always real. Mine's always real. Yeah. Mine's always real. Yours Same. Always real. <laughs> <laughs> what is the craziest sexual experience that you've ever had? Hmm. If you can think of one. Yeah, I'm like, there's just so many. Oh, there's a lot. They're all so weird. Because, like, dark rooms are pretty weird. The alley. Yeah. The dark alley. The alleys. Plural. Well, so a guy on Sniffy's wanted to buy my thong. And so we drove up to the top of, like, my parking garage because my roommate was home. So I wasn't going to, like, do that. Yeah. So I got in his car and he bought my thong. But, like, the act of selling him my thong turned me on. So I let him fuck me, too. So I guess oh, yeah. he, like, paid for my thong and then we had sex oh. for free. So I'm not a prostitute. That's cool. <laughs> on a technicality. <laughs> Technically, you didn't do it for sex. You yeah, did yeah. It just for the exchange. Yeah, I was there and I was like, wait, that turned me on. Okay. Was he hot? Yeah, he was pretty hot. Oh. Okay. I, was, I was surprised. It was actually someone I knew from the bars. Oh. Because we didn't exchange faces. And so when I showed up, I was like, oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well. <laughs> he knew who you were. Well, no, my face wasn't on the sniff. Oh. It was just like me. He didn't know was, who you were. No, it was just me and a thong. And he wanted to buy the thong. What? And I was like, yeah, sure. Okay. Wow. Do you see him out? Yeah. Do you hook up? No, no, no. No. I probably would if you wanted to buy another thong. Yeah. So yeah. come and buy another thong. Yeah. <laughs> He's waiting for the message. Yeah, yeah. I am waiting. Try to put double, though. Yeah. Be double. Double what? The, the price. The price. Oh, yeah. Charge. Well, I didn't say how much I charged. No, but double it. Double it. You don't have to tell us if how much. If it's a much, thousand charge, too. Yeah, yeah I'll double it. <laughs> <laughs> and double it again. Premium. What about, like, the worst experience? Oh, wait. This one's hilarious. This one's hilarious. Um, so I was dating a guy in high school, slash we were best friends. Um, he was like iffy about the whole dating word. Um, and he was blowing me and um, we were like in my childhood bed and he's blowing me and then I hear a and then I hear a So he like vomited on my dick, but then slurped it up. And then he ran across the room and like vomited in my trash can. Dang. And I was like, oh my God. And it was like such a compliment, but also like disgusting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so. But did you finish? Eventually, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I went and wiped off and I was like, okay. Yeah, <laughs> get back down. <laughs> just just fault, flip so. over. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. Sweet. That's sweet. Mm -hmm. I, I called him Sir. Uh, he slurped it up and then went. Yeah, yeah, at least he didn't just like make me change the sheets. That's Very nice friend you asked. <laughs> I'm hoping we're not too dark in this. It is pretty dark. Whoa, that was bright. Yeah, it's like daytime. Yeah. We look great. Sorry for that brief interruption. <laughs> we had intermission. We had to turn the sun back on. Apparently the sun <laughs> goes down in, in Vegas. And now it's time for lightning round. Ready? I'm ready. All right. Dom or sub? Like, oh, it depends on if I'm topping or bottoming. Are you a dom or sub? If I'm topping. But I'm so multi The next interaction you want to have. The next interaction? <sighs> Sub. Okay. Sub. Uh, hairy or smooth? Hairy. Top or bottom? More bottom. Oral or anal? Anal. Now or later? Now. Public or private? Public. <laughs> if you're into <laughs> them, rope or handcuffs? Neither. Neither. Well, mm -mm. Yeah. No, nope. I'm a Capricorn. Oh, 
Oh, you like to be in charge. I like my freedom. Yeah. You won! Yay! Do you have kinks? Um, I just like really hot sex. So like, that's my kink. I really don't like, not really into peeing. I guess I'm vanilla, just like turn up the volume. Okay, I'm that's vanilla good. too. Sometimes a non. So. Oh yeah. yeah, the non can be hot. When I'm in the mood. Yeah. yeah. The steam room or um, sauna? No, just open door. Yeah. Oh, What's yeah? the most public yeah. place that you've had sex? Because you answered that before we even said private. You're like, public, public, yes. Well, I like, when I'm feeling frisky, I like try to, like very public. I have an aban or like a closed construction site because mm. that was really hot. And then um, the top of my parking garage because there's like this really pretty view of the city. Many times, but it sounds uh, like Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you will probably know <laughs> if you've been to Dallas. <laughs> <laughs> um, you can hear me from down the block. Um, <laughs> Are you loud in, in public setting? When yeah, when I'm getting like fucked hard, then I'm yeah. like yeah. Um, and then surprisingly, like for the amount of sex I have in public, oh the um, a specific dance club in Dallas that stays open to four a.m. the dance floor like all the time. <laughs> No. Just constantly, there's just like girls everywhere, and I'm just like getting fucked, and it's fine. It's great. Oh, like so it's icon. you that we've seen on the dance It's me. <laughs> so that's you on the dance floor. It's me. And there's like a huge, like, Sniffy's cruising hotspot. I've like never been. For the amount I cruise and like have sex in public, I don't actually hit the hotspots. Oh. Because I'm a Capricorn. Not yet. Yeah. <laughs> Not yet. Not yet. Yeah. Well, we have one last question. Mm -hmm. Are you cut or uncut? Don't tell us. Oh. They want to see. They want to see. Okay. We're gonna do a reveal. A reveal. If you're down. A reveal. Wait a second. We'll Drop trunk. So eager. Look at this warm. Yeah, nice bust. Nice bust if it's fake. You like, do squats for sure. I do. <laughs> I never okay. skip like this. Ready? Yeah. Are you ready? Ready. My Three. Cold. I'm sorry. Two. One. one. Damn, all that cake. Whoa. Literally. <laughs> you're. Every time I'm so used you get to it right. <laughs> With our freezing cold hands on your body. Oh, warming you up. Does it I've turn got... you on? Oh, it does. It does? <laughs> I love getting massages and it's like massage resentment. Massage, massage. Oh, there you go. Cool. Mm. That's how we always start part two. So. Oh, yeah. That's <laughs> what so I figured. I was like, this feels like a segue moment. Yeah, this, this is, segue. is a segue. <laughs> Ready for part two. Cool. Hang on. Okay. Cold? No, you're getting me hot. <laughs> Same. <laughs> Should we do part two? <laughs> <laughs>